In this video, I'm going to show you how to export your audio from Adobe Premiere Pro without the video. So this is an audio only export. So once you're inside of Adobe Premiere Pro, as you can see, I've got this footage here, the audio is here and the video is here. So normally if I would export, I would just go into file, export, media. And of course the keyboard shortcut for that is command M or control M if you're on Windows. And then I would just go through all of these different settings here and just export the video and the audio. But because we don't want the video, we want to go ahead and change a few of these settings here. So we're just going to first of all change the format from H.264 or whatever it's set to. And you can either set that to waveform audio or you can export that to MP3. So I'm going to select MP3 and as you can see instantly it's got rid of that video. Now from here you can go ahead and select a preset so you can go MP3 128 kilobits per second, 192 or 256. Now if you want the highest possible quality audio, I would recommend going for 256. Of course this will increase the size of your file, but because we're working with audio only, it's not going to be massive. So just go ahead and select the highest quality. Then you can go ahead and put this somewhere on your computer. So we'll go output name, we'll select sequence 01. We'll make a folder on our desktop, so we'll call this export. And we can go ahead and rename this to whatever we like. Now moving down, we've got audio and we've got our basic audio settings. So you can either export the mono channel or a stereo channel. So a mono is just going to mix everything into one and the stereo is going to mix it into the two different channels. Then we've got our audio bitrate. So you can select 320 if you wanted to make that even higher, but you can keep this at 256 and that's still going to be a really nice high quality. And then you've got the codec quality, so you can select fast or high, but I'm going to select high because it's going to give us that cleanest export from the audio. And then all you have to do from there is just press export. Premiere will take a few minutes and then it's just going to go ahead, export that audio. And when you look at that in the finder, it's just going to be the audio only and the video won't be attached. So there you go. That's it for this video. It was really quick and really simple and hopefully this managed to answer your question. So thank you ever so much for watching and hopefully I will see you on the next video. See you there.